AJ, we're normally a sports show in the draft is happening in two days from now. But did you see what Levitar just did? That's fucking great news for everybody. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, I have no idea what happened just now. First things first, massive congratulations to the Dan Levitard show. Yeah, yeah. Here's Dan and Poppy. It is not easy to go independent and continue to be a profitable business. Obviously, they proved they were that and then some. DraftKings just made a $50 million investment, I guess, or a deal to license the show. Uh, so can fucking... Shout out! Shout out! Woo! Massive congrats. Obviously, we are a FanDuel show, a much better app, and much more convenient, and more odds, and, and better odds, and, mm -hmm. and more bets, and everything like that. Yep. But with that being said, incredible work by Dan Levitard and their team over there. Very, 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 very happy for them. Oh, I mean, that's amazing what they're able to do. Like, he's able to break off on his own and get a deal like that. Where Now, where will people watch and listen to this? Not 100% sure. I think it, the deal said just podcast or whatever, but I assume what is well, it? Didn't, didn't he start a production company with Skipper? Yeah, Meadowlark Media, but I assume that all their podcasts will probably be DraftKings podcasts. I don't know. More and more information will, I assume, will roll out, but uh, I am. I'm incredibly impressed that they were able to make the transition so seamlessly. That's great work by them. Uh, and also, that is that is fantastic teamwork being done by Dan Lebetard there. And I am, uh, he doesn't even know it. We're not even on the same team. No. Uh, but I, I am very, very thankful for, for what Dan Lebetard just did. Anyway, hey, that Dan Lebetard news is the biggest news I've ever met. So what? And so it's a licensing deal with DraftKings, and so where will it be then? And is it with like his whole the whole company that he and Skipper started? Like what what's going on? I'd assume I'd assume it's the whole company. I have no idea the distribution. That'll probably come rolling out. But it sounds like it is just the podcast that they signed that deal for. Which and if that's the case, <laughs> shout out to fucking Levitard yeah. and John Skipper. Thank yeah. you, Levitard. Hey. It's incredible Coffee. business. That's the OGs of the business right there, Wild. by the doing their thing. That's huge that, news. So that's because so DraftKings just wants to get into more than just gambling. Is that right, why they're doing this? Oh, they got VSIN, right? They just bought VSIN, which is just a radio. Um, <laughs> that one was interesting to me, but I do. I think they have some heavy hitters on on VSIN that are notable. So it's like a good hire. I, I, I think that was a good thing. That the number was also very good news whenever we heard it. Then the the Levitard podcast, like you want to be able to get people that have an audience, obviously. So that's the big game here, especially in the sports gambling world. So I think they get Levitard in there because he has proven, I guess, now that since he's gone independent, his following is a loyal one and an active one. So everything, everybody's in an arms race right now. Everybody's in an arms race. They're, they're trying to get people on their platforms and everything like that. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, that, that is just really, I mean, that's very, very good news. It's very, very good news. And I'm very happy for them, too, because yeah. I assume it was very stressful. I assume there were some stressful days. Whenever you go independent and you have employees, there's a lot of moments where you're like, oh, shit, I hope this works. And here we are, and it definitely has good for them. I'm fucking pumped for them and well, for I us. Think, but don't it, you think it, it shows how, I guess, like how invested, how engaged his fans are? Like people that are Levitard fans, like they love him, and they, talk, they watch the show every single day, I feel like. They must be. The, 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 with the deal, like they they must be legitimately. That's a massive. That is a massive deal for podcasts. Three of them. From what three, I oh, is that what it, three three are included? With I, don't know who? They, I don't know. Maybe all the pod. I don't know how many podcasts they got. They just brought in Adnan. I saw they had a new hire the other day. Mm -hmm. They got Levitard Show. Levitard Show is put out hourly, right? I think yeah, is yep. podcast. They put it out as hourly show. Then the um, they have other shit, but yeah, I think Levitard is the driver behind it. Then the other shows around it. I assume DraftKings was like, okay, we would like to get involved with that. That is something they're in on. DraftKings might be buying everything too. By the way, it feels yep. like mm -hmm. DraftKings might be big, big, big spenders, being like, hey, whatever we need, let's go get because this is a ten-year trillion-dollar thing that we're looking at here. It's a new world, man. It's a new news. world. Aren't you glad that you uh, you started before most people? AJ, AJ, that Levitard news today was some of the greatest shit I've ever read in my entire life. Uh -huh. <laughs> hey, I want to let you know. That. Ever. I mean, that I agree Like you should be very excited about it, but there's been other similar style news, things like this that have come out that should get you very excited as well before this. Oh, yeah. I mean, listen, 
what Portnoy has done both with the Churning Group and then with Penn, fucking unbelievable. Rogan and all of everybody at Barstow, not just Portnoy, obviously, there's monsters over there. That's incredible in the gambling world. Rogan going to Spotify, okay? Massive deal, awesome deal. Very pumped about it. But those two, you know, the OGs of the game there. Those are OGs of the mm -hmm. internet game right there. Those two have been doing the business of the internet a long time. Simmons with Ringer, they've been doing the internet for a long, long time. Levitard just got into this game and he just got paid that. That's unbelievable for Levitard. Incredibly earned and really, really good. But when I read it, I was very happy for them. And then I immediately thought, oh, wait a minute. Okay, we are buying a plane. Yeah. Okay, that, that, was, that was my immediate first couple of thoughts. But uh, who knows how the tide will turn as we move forward, you know? But I think it's a big wave. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> the wave seems to be getting bigger. Get the surfboard out, dude. It feels like that son of a bitch is getting big, you know? They say when the tide rises, it's good for every boat. That's uh -huh. right. Amen. One of those waves you need a jet ski to tow you out oh. this, this, with, the, with the board? Uh, you, you're talking about a tugboat? Oh. oh, yeah. Oh, no, no, you're talking about whenever the, the, the waves get so big, you're on the back of a jet ski? Yeah. Oh. Bingo, pal. Oh, yeah. And it's me and a bulldog, an English bulldog standing on the front. <laughs> That's, okay? That's what we're doing. We're having a good time out here. People are going to love that video. <laughs> might have to turn and run. This might be a tsunami situation. Uh, no, no, no. No, this is one of those ones you run right into. Mm -hmm. Point okay. break. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Listen, as somebody who is Two. Oh. blown out an eardrum, from fighting an actual wave mm -hmm. in Atlantic City, New Jersey. Mm -hmm. I am all about running away from a wave. This particular one is one that we're gonna wanna stare right down. Yep. And let's go ahead and do that. It's a good day to have a good day, isn't it? Congrats, let me tell you. Yeah. Fucking pumped. Hey, <laughs> it's all kinda hitting me right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tsunami. Yeah. So when are you moving into the church? <laughs> I mean, at this point, we could probably have, if if I'm viewing things right, <laughs> which I think I am. Which you are. <laughs> I'm just doing some math quickly in my head on things that, you know, I've seen and heard and know. The first church will open here in a few months. Yeah. We will have numerous churches. Oh, we, yeah. will have, we will have churches from what I, I do believe. We'll, we'll have a lot of live shows. You know, we'll just have live venues, I think, uh -huh. in a lot of places. Just come on in. Water is fine. Maybe get Easter bee on Sundays. Yes. Oh, oh, the yep. booking fee for an Easter bee must be so high. We'll be able to afford it. Yep. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's get to a break for 20 <laughs> hours or so. I got to go shoot something uh, with the Colts. But Ooh. Oh, Here we go. I'm up to something. I'm up to something. <laughs> yeah.